So guys, you forgot the password to your Windows 10 device, and now you can't get in. So, you may be asking yourself, what am I supposed to do at this point? So guys, if this is your situation and you have forgot your password to your Windows 10 device, then you have come to the right video. Hey, what is up guys, Summit here, and I am back with another video. Today guys, I am going to be showing you what you're supposed to do to handle the situation and how you can get inside of your Windows 10 computer if you forgot the password to it. So let's get started. So guys, the first thing that you actually want to do is you want to try to see what type of a password you have on your computer. What I mean by this is you want to see whether your password is, a, is your Microsoft account password or it's a password that you have put on your own. So um basically what that means is if your password to get inside of your computer is actually just your microsoft account password then really all you have to do if you forgot it is to actually reset your microsoft account password and you can do that on another computer you can reset the password on another computer and um yeah so it is actually that really that simple if you have a microsoft account to reset your password but guys, a lot of people, including me, have actually a PIN system or other types of passwords that they put on their own, which is not their actual Microsoft password. So what are you supposed to do in a situation like that? So that is what I'm going to be covering in this video. So guys, before starting, I just wanted to warn you that this doing this method will like remove all of your data. And um, the thing is that if you do have a backup, you can definitely restore all your data back onto your computer but I just wanted to just get that out of the way to make sure that you guys understand that this will remove your data okay anyways now that that is out of the way let's uh, get started with the process so guys the first thing that you want to do is you want to locate this power button over here as you can see you want to click on it and you want to hold the shift key you want to keep the shift key pressed and you want to hit restart you want to hit restart anyway if you have that and you want to keep the shift key pressed while these uh, the screen is on <clears throat> okay so this is actually gonna take you to this screen over here and uh, once you're on this screen all you have to do is click over here on troubleshoot you want to go ahead and click on reset this PC and you want to click on remove everything Okay, so you're gonna get this Dell load up screen and um, it's gonna take you to the preparing screen. So just preparing to uh, remove the data that you have on your uh, device. Okay guys, once that is done, you will get a screen over here in just a sec. That says reset this PC, getting things ready. Now this screen can take some time, so uh, you definitely should wait a bit. Okay, and now you will be taken to this screen over here, reset this PC, and you wanna just go ahead and click on just remove my files. And again, you will get this getting things ready screen, which again can take some time, so you should definitely wait for it. Okay, and finally, you will get this screen over here, which has reset this PC, all ready to go, make sure that your PC is plugged in, and it will basically tell you what resetting will do. And basically, it's just gonna remove all of the data on your computer. And uh, basically, you will just wanna go ahead and click reset over here. And what this is gonna do is it's just gonna remove all of your data, and it's gonna take you back to the position that you were in when you first set up this computer, right? When you first took it out of the box, when you first set it up, it's gonna take you back to that exact same place. And uh, yeah, basically you're just gonna set up your computer like you would normally. And then if you have a backup on, let's say, a different hard drive or even virtually, then you can just restore that backup from there. Now guys, I don't wanna do this right now because I do have a lot of information that I haven't backed up. But that is basically all you have to do. You just have to hit the reset button and you'll be good to go. Okay, so guys, really, that is about it. Um, it, it is really that simple to actually uh, remove, uh, to actually reset your computer and to actually um, get inside of your Windows 10 device if you forgot the password to it. And guys, the thing is that this just doesn't work on Windows 10. Um, 
only it actually also works on Windows 8 and some other Windows firmware so you can definitely give this a try even if you don't have Windows 10 and yeah guys that is really about it to this video um so that is how you get into your Windows 10 device if you forgot the password to it so guys thank you so much for watching this video if this video helped you please hit that like button and please subscribe to my channel for more such videos I upload as frequently as possible and yeah guys that is about it I will see you in the next video until then peace